Hello everyone and thanks for tuning in. How are you guys doing? Um, I just want to let you know guys, I'm sorry I hadn't uploaded a video in a few days. I haven't been feeling well so I've been up under the weather a little bit, but I'm back and I'm feeling a lot better. You know guys, as I told you on last year, I had COVID around March, April, I can't remember around March. Yeah, something real around March, my whole family had COVID. But when I had COVID, I was asymptomatic last time, which means I had no symptoms at all. So I'm like, oh my goodness, I have not been sick. But this time I don't have COVID, but I had a cold. I was sicker with the cold than I was when I had COVID. But I thank God I'm back. So I want to show you guys, I went to Walmart and I went to Sam's. So I got a small, um, small haul of what I purchased when I was there. So you know how we go to the grocery store to pick up a few things and it doesn't turn that way. But what the thing of it was is that starting next month, I think I'm gonna start ordering my groceries from Walmart and um, having them to deliver them. My sister and I were talking about the price and everything. So I'm gonna be looking up that, giving you guys some ideas of what you'd like to do. Cause some people just like to get out in the community and shop, that's me, I like to get out in the community. But with everything that's going on right now, I don't know if I really wanna go out there. You know, after a while I'm trying to, I have been since the COVID last time, I've been trying to keep everything a little bit over what I need. I mean, I've been buying a lot more so I can have it stored so I don't have to go out if I don't want to go out. But by me being sick, the few days I was sick, I wasn't able to go out and do things. So everything in the home is a little threw off because when the person that does the shopping, does the cleaning, does the cooking, just maintains the home, in other words, when they're down, it's kind of hard. So guys, I just want to let you know, I just picked up a few things while I was out today. Like um, when I was at Sam's, I just, we didn't need a whole lot of stuff. We just needed a few things to add to what we had. So what I'm going to be doing today is on this video, just showing you what I've gotten. And by the way, guys, I'm going to show you later. I don't know if it'll, what I'm going to put in that video up, but I'm going to show you the um, lettuce wrap. I told you guys about, I had bought that last time with the sounds. By me being sick, I didn't make the lettuce wrap. So I'm gonna make that for dinner tonight. So guys, I just wanna show you a few of the things I got. And I need to ask some, some, some of you guys some questions. Now, I don't usually get the Dawn Platinum, four times power. I usually get the regular Dawn because I like that Dawn better, but I didn't see the regular Dawn at Sam's. So this is the one Sam's is carrying. Then they have like a member's mark one that looks like this. So guys, in the comments, if someone can tell me if this is really good, I don't know, because I usually like to stick with what I get. And if I can't find the Dawn, I'll probably have to go to like Home Depot because Home Depot carries the regular Dawn because I like the strength of the Dawn. I like the way it cleans. And look guys, I am low really low so i today i'll be doing videos where i'll be cleaning filling up everything refilling and i'm um, trying to get everything caught up from the time that i was sick so just like i told you i got the juices from sam which is just the regular welch's juices you get these the welch's you know so you can have all those and my um adult children they drink those too and then i get the snacks for her this time i tried this variety pack because with the other pack i get some of the cookies zoe doesn't like so i decided i try this because this has the three pack and it i don't want anything to get where they don't want to eat it because they don't eat it then i have to throw it out so i got these and it just has the oreos nutty bars nutty butter and the chips are holes. and then like i tell you the juices and I've been making the pizzas lately, guys. I told you guys I was going to make the pizzas with the English muffin, and they come out so good. It's just English muffins cut in half, throw a little, um, um, throw a little tomato sauce on it, and some pepperoni, and lots of mozzarella cheese. And my family has been loving those, and I've been giving those to them. And also the Hot Pockets, they haven't been carrying these at Sam's in a while, because I used to buy them all the time. So I got the Hot Pockets, because this can be lunch for young, I mean, my sons when they go back. Also, um, you guys, when you're in the store, I need you guys to be noticing some things, because usually the stir fry mix like this is hard to find. Now all you see when I went in today, they just have this type of stir fry mix. They don't have the normally and another kind of stir -fry. So the stores are limit, get, become, beginning to be limited on certain items, and that's kind of making me think like maybe I need to, you know, stockpile a little bit more. But by me having just the freezer that I have, it's not very big, 
but I used to keep my vegetables, frozen vegetables, and um, I was just wondering, you know, they don't have, and I was there early because I used to go to the store very early. As soon as I get Zoe on the bus, I'm at the store. So I was wondering what was going on with that. And I just picked up once again some chicken breasts, and these were like $10. And then the salmon, which was good today, they had lots of packs of the salmon, and I like to serve the salmon at least once a week. So I got these two packs, and these were only like 16 and this one was like $17. And you can't beat that, and they're already pre-packaged, so it makes it easier for me, because I need to take it out, cut it up, and um, leave it in the freezer, section it, so that when I get ready to use it, I have it all sectioned off. And then I just picked up my regular bread that I always do to Sara Lee. And this is something I want to ask you guys about too. This is the Tide Pods. I never tried these before. Tide, oh here we go, Tide Pods. And this is 104 pods, right? It says 104 packs, capsules, four bag sections. So I've never used this, but I want to try it because usually when I saw it before in the stores, it's usually very expensive. So since it was so expensive, I really didn't want to purchase it because I was like, I'm not going to do that. I really use, I'm kind of old schoolish with that. I just want to use like the um, regular laundry detergent. I use regular Tide and the April Fresh, and then I usually use like a fabric softener, but I stopped using the fabric softener when I found the Tide had a fabric softener in it. So that slowed me down purchasing a lot of the fabric softener because I used to buy everything in bundles because I like to have, you know, a lot of it on hand because I don't like to run to the store, keep running to the store for certain things. And that's been the same way when it comes to tissue. They say I'm just a trip, but I like to have everything on hand. I'm just turning the camera around, guys, so you can see this side is still, I still got stuff to show you. So also I got me some um, cooking oil that I needed from, um, I, here I went to Sam's and on here I went to Walmart and I just picked up this thing of oil because I didn't want to get the ones that had a Sam's, the two pack. This is a more than enough. And then I got these um, right here. The fridge, freezer, fridge and freezer um, baking soda. And these I like to put in my refrigerator. They work better because I, I don't like when the baking soda, the regular baking soda, it um, falls and gets all over the place. These are a lot better. I like these. And also just some things to make salad, some tomatoes and lettuce and all that for the wraps tonight. And then I also got hamburger. So what I'm trying to do, guys, is get the way I kind of plan my meals out a little better. And I got just the hamburger from Walmart. And I got to um, restock the sugar. I got the sugar from there, too. Because I really sometimes like to get the big, big one from Sam's because I have places to stock it, but I don't like to have too much of an overflow. So that's there. And then, guys, this is what I really wanted to show you guys. I got, and I haven't seen this in a while. I got the bag time, excuse me. But this, this is Lysol. This is Lysol right here. This is a Lysol that my mom used to use when I was a kid. And she used to pull this out. She didn't have the Lysol like we have the spray Lysol in the can. No, they had this. This is what my mom would clean up. And, and when I saw it in the store today, I just said, let me get a couple of these. They're kind of pricey, like $4 each. But that's not bad because my sister's like, other places, they're a little bit higher. So what I'm going to do with this is it works. You can put this in your clothing. You can drop a little of this when your laundry is being done, and it's good for that. And also, I just picked up the Lysol clean because I got to clean the refrigerator. You guys will see me in a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and clean the refrigerator. Everything's like really jacked up a little bit because I was sick. And then I got the pledge just clean off my room with it. And also picked up flour so I can fill up the flour can. So once my flour and sugar gets low, I like to go ahead and fill up everything and have it filled. And put this stuff in here. So, and I like the tilapia. And I got tilapia too. So we can have some tilapia. Or maybe we'll do some fish, fish tacos later in the week. And got a lot of these because you can't get too many of these right now with the cold season. And also I picked up some of the donuts so we'll have something to snack on. Some of the donuts, which is always good. So guys, I was just letting you see this little haul I got. I'm gonna come back a little later and I'm gonna work on my refrigerator. And I want you guys to see that. But I just wanna say thanks to all my subscribers for subscribing to the channel. If you like what I'm putting on, just go ahead and like, share, and make sure you hit that notification bell. So each time I upload a video, you will see it. Thanks guys, and I appreciate you guys. And thanks for going with me along, um, letting me show you my small haul. Bye-bye.
Thank you.